Hello, everybody out there in YouTube land. This is CG3, your cryptocurrency coach, coming back at you with a quick tutorial today on how to set up your cryptocurrency wallet. And it's um, it's not um, just a Bitcoin wallet. And so for that reason, I'm calling it a cryptocurrency wallet because the one that I'm recommending today is brought to you by Exodus and uh, in my personal opinion, it's by far one of the best cryptocurrency wallets available. And uh, the main reason is because of the security features it offers. Uh, a lot of wallets that you set up are basically set up online and they are on an, a, um, the, your, your information is on a server, even though it's secure and you have your password, uh, you still have to worry about potential hackers actually hacking that site and getting into your cryptocurrency assets so exodus to me is is definitely superior for the fact that it is not um, online it is uh, on your own personal computer you have control uh, of it and you don't have to worry about any anyone hacking it um, from from a server perspective because you actually uh, host it on your own device whether it's your laptop or your desktop so uh, just adds an extra layer of security there so uh, I am wrecking it, recommending it I use it myself and one of the other good features of the Exodus wallet is it allows you to exchange currencies right in the wallet so if you have Bitcoin for instance and you want to turn that into Ethereum or Litecoin for instance you can actually do that right in the wallet itself. You don't have to take that, uh, your Bitcoin, and go to an exchange and do it and then bring it back into the wallet. You can actually do everything internally. So for that reason, uh, use of ease, uh, I am recommending Exodus. It's something that I use personally myself. So that being said, uh, website is www.exodus.io. Really simple process. Uh, click download and um, put in what device you're downloading it to and the system will pretty much do the rest for you now the other good thing about this is um, you can set up extra layers of security there is a 2FA which is the uh, double um, um, authentication that that just adds again another layer of security um, I personally I don't have it set up on mine I just have mine password protected but if you feel that um, you want that extra layer of security by all means uh, you have that availability um, or you have that ability with the Exodus wallet so um, okay so I just downloaded it and I am going to let it run and I'm going to pause the video here so I can uh, get it set up and then I will we'll return and basically give you a quick walkthrough on how to use it and go from there. Okay, so back at you. Uh, it only took um, about a minute actually. Uh, once I just clicked on the install, uh, the install file, it, in it installs in the background and once it's complete, um, you'll see the Exodus icon and you literally can just click on it and there you go. Um, so Exodus also allows you to restore from a backup. Now I recommend that you do this. It's super, super simple. Um, but the reason you want to do that is because that Exodus wallet is only going to be on the computer that you install it on. So if, for instance, anything were to ever happen to that computer, you actually have a way to restore from your backup so that you don't lose your cryptocurrency assets. Um, again, remember, cryptocurrencies are all digital. It's all Internet protocol. So uh, if you lose it, if you can't access that wallet, you can't access your money. Uh, similar in um, in where you would be accessing your online bank account today where if you lost your username and password you wouldn't be able to access it now good thing is you could just walk into the bank and then you would have uh, you would you know 
could access your funds that way. But remember, this is cryptocurrencies uh, decentralized. There is no uh, central authority or governing body. This is all peer-to-peer. Uh, -peer. So uh, it's the great thing, but it's also the one thing that makes makes it uh, so where you have to be responsible for the storage of your crypto assets and as as well as your uh, your passwords. So uh, again, make sure that you restore or you set up your restore from backup. Again, it's pretty simple process. Um, I'm not going to go through that because uh, it's even though it's simple, it is somewhat um, uh, time consuming. And I'm just trying to keep this video pretty brief. But this is it. This is the Exodus wallet. Um, what you actually start uh, receiving funds into this wallet, this would be your portfolio. So um, whether you had Bitcoin or Dash or EOS or Ethereum or Litecoin, this will show you uh, once you actually log in, it'll show you how much uh, in US dollars that you have or what it equates to. So if you have one Bitcoin, I uh, think Bitcoin today is at 2700 some odd dollars, it would show right here under your Bitcoin amount, it would show you exactly how much you have uh, worth US dollars in Bitcoin. So uh, here's your addresses. Very, very simple. Uh, if you want to send from your Exodus wallet or receive. So in this instance, the very first time that you're sending funds, uh, let's say from Coinbase, let's say you convert some US dollars from Coinbase into Bitcoin. At that time, you would then transfer the money from your Coinbase wallet to your Exodus wallet. And I strongly, strongly recommend that because you never, ever, ever want to leave your uh, your assets, your cryptocurrency assets on an exchange wallet. Let me repeat that. You never want to leave your cryptocurrency assets on an exchange wallet. Coinbase is an exchange, so do not leave your funds there. Um, for those that you know a little bit of history about Bitcoin, um, the whole Mt. Gox debacle, the reason that, that that was so bad was because when Mt. Gox was hacked, all those individuals that had their Bitcoin on the exchange in their exchange wallets were hacked and all their Bitcoins were, were stolen. So um, I never, ever, ever recommend leaving your, your cryptocurrency assets on an exchange wallet. Once you uh, do your transactions, your buys, your sales, um, as soon as you have that in that exchange wallet, send that to your personal Exodus wallet. It is definitely the most secure and protected way to go. So there you have it. That is Exodus. Um, there's the exchange. So if there's any, like I told you, if you have Bitcoin and you want to exchange that to Ethereum or Litecoin, you literally just you know simply click on what you want to exchange it to and you can do everything right there within the exodus wallet so that's that um i hope everybody enjoys this video please leave comments um if there's another uh video that you want me to go through cover something uh any of the other programs that you may see out there just leave it in the comments i'll be more than happy to do that uh, until next time this is cg3 the cryptocurrency coach signing off you guys have a wonderful day